Good evening, everybody. How you guys doing? Hell's Cat Death here. Wednesday Night Bites, bringing you another wonderful action-packed Wednesday evening. We got some ITW going on tonight. Hope everybody is having a wonderful evening. We got some uh, pretty good commentators and crew. First moderator for this match will be an ITW moderator, Mr. Otto1TC. How you doing? Pretty good. How are you, man? Oh, not too bad. Not too bad. Glad, glad to have you in here and moderating this match. Our moderator for the next match after this one, the 10 p.m. match. Um, I have to give him a big giant shout out. What up, legit? How you doing, buddy? I'm doing good. How are you? Not bad. I'll let you get back to what you were doing. <laughs> and then the man, the myth, the legend, uh, the crazy man himself makes evil Knievel jealous. What up, this? How much? It's all those big jumps, right? All right, all right. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking forward to tonight. This is exciting. This is a semifinal matchup uh, in the ITW. And uh, I think both these teams are ready to bring it. Awesome. Warn you, there is a 10 minute delay on this match. So there will be a little bit of pause time in between game one. Oh, sorry the 9 p.m. match and the 10 p.m. match. We're going to play some trickery on the computer system and see if we can make the delay disappear. So, on your six, White Wolves. This is going to be an interesting one. Both teams on your six had a brilliant year in their GTL. They came in third in their division, um, made it on through the playoffs. I forgot the first team that they beat. <clears throat> and... And they, what, inevitably got beat by Poke? Yeah. And then... Yeah, they got, they got uh, beat by Poke, which is now in the semifinals of the GTL taking on L7, so... Right. <laughs> Not a bad team to go down against a team that's advancing that far in uh, the championship bracket. Exactamundo. So, uh, On Your Six can bring it. And we know that White Wolves also is a... Uh, very very capable team um we have some talent over there on that side of the roster got some talent for sure and they've been featured a lot on uh, wnf and uh, they always bring a great performance yes sir and then at the 10 p.m slot we're gonna have a little bit of fun with some more it dubs um we're gonna have rncp with a little bit of mix of rnc guys Mixed in with their second team, I guess it would per se. And then they will be facing the team of Ghost. Awesome. Looks like we already got the timer going for this first match. Uh, I believe White Wolves picked uh, Prokhorovka. So I think we're going to get to see one of the new um, maps that they've uh, kind of digitally redone, uh, which I've been on already. It looks beautiful. Um, We'll be seeing that first off. And this yes, was White sir. Wolf's pick. Yeah. And with the great quality, make sure to turn that up on your phone and also on uh, your Twitch, YouTube, wherever you guys are watching this. Make sure to turn that quality all the way up. So, Absolutely. And you can see it in all of its splendor. Uh, just for those of you who uh, might be new to ITW or uh, need a refresher, uh, this is an encounter mode map. Uh, so the encounter, we're not doing multi-base. Uh, it's going to be over there on that EF78, kind of where you see the little group of buildings there on the map. Um, each team is allowed up to three of a kind of a tank, but you can only have two TDs, uh, two tank destroyers. So as you can see, like on your six already has three uh, super conquerors up. And we are playing in the 880 format, which means that uh, you can have eight tier 10 tanks. Prokhorovka, man, you would think it, you're going to see three Super Conks, three Valors, and, three and, valors. and some bad <laughs> chats. A <laughs> couple bad chats. That, that would be my lineup, yes. And I, so far, true to form, right? Maybe a chisel. Maybe throw a chisel in there somewhere just because of the sure. rotation ability and that wonderful pin and the just gun handling. Hold so, down. Yeah. Yeah. 
little bit different uh, in terms of uh, the encounter strategy. I find that it's, it's, it's a little bit harder to cap on encounter. Uh, what you tend to do is put base cap pressure on, but not, re not really with the intent to cap, more with the intent to draw teams out of their positions. So we'll see uh, which team is going to take advantage of that. Got 20 seconds on timer, and White Wolves only has four tanks. That's not good. No, 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 Otto. It is not good. Hopefully they get their act together here. What else did you want to do on your six side, and we'll sure. grab uh, White Wolves when we start? Sounds great. All right, on your six, my good buddy TLP Weasel. What up? Rocking out an E6 cutter. <clears throat> Bringing out that batch at Banshee and the IS-7. The Valors, and I will continue to go through them once we get up and going. I just was not fast enough. Yeah. That's all right. Um, That's okay. It looked like White Wolves was short a tank. Did I? Did you see that, Otto? Yeah. Yeah, they're short one. That's, that is not that a good move for a playoff match. Yeah. Playing the clock and lost. They were. I don't know if they were having comms issues, but normally, especially on the first match, you don't want to. All right, really fast. Don't want to mess around with getting tanks up. Go ahead. Boxcar, Leopard, Lonky, all in Super Conks. Butane and Beaver both pulling in those Valors. Banshee in the IS-7 is, and as I said, Cutter in the bat chat with the Weasel. Sorry about bringing up that big, ugly map. But there we go, Disc. Go ahead and run down the... Yeah, yeah. I'll go over the White Wolf side. We have a Dragoon Chief in a Super Conqueror along with the Royal Blood and T for TK. We also have double Valors with Ghost is Mad and Ninja, and then War Sausage in a Bat Chat. So it looks like they're probably down either a Bat Chat or possibly a Valor on the uh, White Wolf side. Not impossible to win a 7v8, but it, gosh, it sure makes it hard. Right. They're going to have to stay very grouped together, in my opinion, and rely on War Sausage to do uh, a lot of good scouting and intel. So really quick, they're It's disc. actually a 6v8. On your 6v8. Oh, Yep. On your six, actually went into this. Uh, they didn't see any tanks, so they don't know the the rooms blank to them. Oh, so why uh, is that? I don't. It's it's bugged. It's glitched. So, yeah, on your six, do, it doesn't. Not until they got into the game knew what they were playing against. They had no idea what they uh, White Wolves even brought out. Interesting. Okay. Definitely some glitches and some bugs. What do we expect? It was a badass update, and a lot of good stuff came mm -hmm. out of it. So, I would think if you're uh, if you have a two tank advantage, I didn't even catch that legit. Uh, I would think you'd want to be kind of a, just aggressive and not get picked apart. Is it to be a overmatch somewhere? On your six being very cautious, they're all stacked on the inside of the track there on that uh, seven line. Trying to get some good intel. They've also moved some tanks up on the zero line on the hill. You can see those Valors up there along with that E6. That's pretty filthy with that gun depression up there and those turrets. Rotate this camera around. Yeah. Look at the wave. It looks like White Wolves, yeah, they want to get up there in that DE0 position, uh, which I think is a good counter position, a good defensible position. That way they can throw shots down on those tanks below. Definitely have uh, put themselves with their six tanks in a in a pretty good little turtle position. I like where uh, Dragoon Chief is, hull down right there, holding the backside of the bridge, and then here on the hill. About as good as you can expect for six tanks, but they are starting to bleed a little bit. Looks like uh, on your six is moving on the zero line up over the hill, and that is exactly the right move. Pressure these three tanks. You have Banshee down below, um, along with box cars. 
now the three tanks coming over the top. So they're going to try to put the squeeze on these tanks here. Ooh, fire. Focus fire is pretty good there. We've got a fire going. First tank goes down for White Wolf, Super Conqueror. Or sausage still on a reload. But White Wolf's is doing a good job of picking on Banshee there. Banshee's a one shot in his IS seven. Warsaw and they get Banshee goes down. War Sausage is gonna be able to clip out Weasel. Weasel's paying no attention to the bat chat that is now yeah. reloaded on his six. Literally. Yep. Yep. Hey, sometimes you just you, you shoot at what your collar tells you to shoot at and you ignore. <laughs> ignore. <laughs> Yeah, War Sausage is going to pay the price for... He got a tank out, but he's now on reload, and... Maybe he'll get out, but no. Big shot there. He's a one-shot now. This is just a cleanup for uh, On Your Six now. Ninja's down Ninja to a one-shot. Ninja goes down. Yeah, Dragoon Chief goes down, and it's just Sausage left. So unfortunate there for White Wolves uh, that they were only able to get six out of eight tanks up in that first match. Um, love to see them play at full strength, so hopefully they can get all their tanks together in the next match. You want to do some damage there, Dis? Absolutely, I'd love to ball. go down damage. Yep, looking over there on the White Wolf side. Um, Sausage, you saw him get that nice clip off there in the bat chat, put up 1125. Uh, picked up a kill. Uh, other two notables for White Wolves was Dragoon Chief and his Super Conqueror putting up 2,500 and picking up a kill. And then also Ninja and his Valor uh, putting up 2,700 in damage. So uh, that was about it in terms of big numbers over there for White Wolves. When we look over here at the On Your Six team, we have a nice damage spread across the board. Uh, Banshee and his IS-7 putting up 11.79. Uh, pretty decent game right there. Cutter in his batch hat picking up a kill, putting up 1,600 in damage. Flashy Leopard in a Super Conqueror picking up a kill, 2,600 in damage. Uh, his buddy, buddy Lunky, uh, in a Super Conqueror with another kill and just over 1,200 in damage. A couple other big hitters there. Brother Butane in the Valor with a kill, 2,600 in damage, and then Beaver. Uh, talk about another man, the myth, the legend, yes. with a kill in his Valor, and putting up 2,900 in damage. So GG's to On Your Six. We will uh, flip spawns and uh, try to get all the tanks up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel bad for, for White Wolves on that one. Gosh. I mean, they were doing some pretty good damage, but, man, that 6v8 is not fun. Oh, that's rough. It's rough. I've, uh, you know, I think anybody who's played comp, let's, uh, let's admit it, Otto, we've all been there where we didn't get a tank up, <laughs> you know, right. and it's like, oh, it's such a defeating gut punch before you even start. And the caller tries to rally everyone, but, you know, it's, it's hard uh, when you know... You know, you're missing uh, that firepower. Yeah. White Wolves not so... messing around now. <laughs> yeah, it just takes so many. Yeah, I'm sure there was a little uh, team meeting real quick. Uh, <laughs> team huddle. <laughs> so put the tanks up. A little bit of coming to Jesus on that one. <laughs> yeah, and you know, and it's all sorts of things. Sometimes you're overthinking it. Sometimes the person who's supposed to put the tank up didn't hear you. Uh, it could be comms, uh, you could be playing the clock. Hell can, Hells can tell you he does not like playing the clock game. Mm. Where you put them all up in the last 20 seconds. <laughs> nope. Nope. <laughs> He's not a fan. I think one of the worst feelings I've ever had is having one of your teammates get ammo racked right off the bat. Just all their health just gone. Oh. That's, yeah. that is uh, detrimental to your team it's, when that happens it's like that or you lose your light tank in the first 30 seconds of the game you know right. it's double tracked and focused and you're like okay Here, i'm going to do the tanks really fast so daff and the 268 war sausage in the is seven terror blood and kawasaki ninja all in valors chief ghost 
and T for TK, all in super comps. So what do you do? Yeah, and on your sixth side, we got Cutter in that bat chat, Banshee in the machine, then triple Valors, Butane, Weasel, and Beaver, and then triple Super Conks, Flashy Leopard, Thrawn, and Lunky. I say ball. Super Conky Donk for her. I love yeah, that. Yeah, go one. ahead. <laughs> so, Oddball, <laughs> I'm going to let that one slide out here at Wednesday night. How do you save a tree? You eat a beaver at On Your Six. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's a good one there, Oddball. Good one. Very funny. All right. 268, interesting pick. Um, definitely see that kind of more sitting back on the rails unless you're going to do something kind of crazy like push down the one. Uh, so we'll see what White Wolves has in store for that 261. Not really the type of tank you'd throw up maybe on the one line or something like that. Doesn't quite have that gun, gun depression to yeah. make that work. I would figure eight. Let's have speed. I was figuring mm -hmm. eight down there in that the, the, the little cup. Yeah. You can really reach out. To, uh, seeing a two six one uh, able to really punish that hotel zero um, and golf zero hill quite well with that two six one. All right, well, we will have eyes open on where that tank ends up. Yeah, right. I mean, even on both sides, because on the other side of the cusp, I mean, a K, what is that, K8, there's a really good bush that you can, I can, here, I'm talking about Artie, we're talking about a 268, my bad. I'm oh, no, no, you're, you're good. That's all right. Are, are you allowed to use Artie in the uh, IT dub? Yeah, there's no rule against it. Not as, no rule against not, not yet, anyway. Not yet. Well, I, I do think that 268, though, is going to go over here to the railroad and kind of watch the backside. I think that's the move there. And White Wolves has elected to send just about everything to the ridge line, as does on your six. So we're, we're in here for a, kind of almost a mere strat of one another. Banshee, though, is going to take the bull. Banshee does get the bull. So that's going to be pretty yeah, dangerous. He's got to be picky on which which targets he picks, though, because... I would almost just chill and let, let his buddies do the work of turning turrets and then drop that clip on someone. Right. Look at Cutter. Cutter's making a nice move. I like what Cutter's doing right now. He's rotating out to the one line. Super like comps are pushing the detect. machine. And they're getting yeah. paid for it. Badly. TK's oh. not even going to make it. TK's a one. Oh, oh, Mad, gets, a oh. Mad gets set on fire. Not a good trade. That was a great bait play, actually, right? uh, by putting that machine in there. Uh, they thought they had to overmatch, and nope. Both those Super Conquerors paid dearly for that uh, effort. I think... Uh, Banshee didn't even take any damage till right now. Here comes Cutter now. He's going to be able to ease in the bull. Yep. Right. I think before those Super Conquerors pushed, I think his plan was to get in behind them. And I think he, he'll go after Dragoon Chief. Dragoon is right. kind of isolated in this low dip. Not sure if that 268 has really been able to do anything back there. I'll have to look at the damage after the after getting it. Legit, legit, thank you for the Minus? subscribe. Eight months worth. You demand hey. legit. Kind of surprised that Banshee and Cutter didn't take both those auto loaders in this clip out, Chief. Maybe they're a little worried that. Um, Wonder where the six eight is. Valors could push over. Yeah, that, where that two six eight is. Yeah, you didn't want to take that big alpha hit. Cutter's now re-rotating. I do like on your six patients here. They they have a two tank advantage. They have hit points are fairly even. 
Uh, but this is the advantage of having a medium tank is you can make these type of Ooh, rotations. Oh, Banshee just get getting intel. slapped. 850 shot from the 268. Ooh, not the shot he wanted to take. Oh, no, he backed way down. <laughs> yep, use those super well, conkles. The good thing is, though, he can give uh, Cutter some intel. Cutter's going to find him right now. If Cutter can get in behind him and drop a clip here, this is at a, yeah, 268 is already turning. Rounds now coming in from downtown yeah, onto the 268. Good play. Yep. Oh, there it is. Let us hold down tanks. Just rip this 268 up. Oh, 268 mi misses it. Uh, there it is. Beaver gets it. down. Cutter, Cutter made a beautiful play there. Really nice. Good clip. Air's going to get clipped it's, from the rear. Well, not really clipped, but he's going to be. Yeah. Well, and he also turned the guns. Look, you know, you have terror. Coming down to try to get Cutter. He's right. not even looking at the tank shooting at him from the ridge line. Well, that's the downside. Once you lock your team on F line, that ro uh, rotation tank of like Cutter, you can't fall back. There's no way. You just mm -hmm. get bled out. And so you're stuck in motion, and now you have a bat chat that's just going to sit there and farm you on the rear. Yep. It's exactly what he's doing right now. He's going, dumping that clip into Royal Blood right now. Royal Blood's down to a two. And a fire, and boom, there goes Royal Blood. Beautiful uh, cutter. Boy, what a game. Right. On your six, held out. They kept their, their heads low, just took it. cool? Yep. Nobody died. Wow, and then look at that damage spread on, on your six. Uh, I don't. You can't do it much better than that. Right. You want to do some white wolves on white wolves? Yeah, yeah. Looking over here on the white wolf side, uh, Dragoon Chief again. You know, he's been playing really well in these matches. Um, in his Super Conqueror, put up uh, just over 1,600 in damage. Royal Blood, who is hanging in there on that ridge until Cutter uh, unloaded that clip into his Valor, put up almost 1,800. Um, and then Ninja in his Valor, he had a super game. Uh, he had 33-38, uh, really good game, blocked over uh, a grand. Uh, so he was playing quite well, and, and so was War Sausage. War Sausage had a great game, putting up almost 3K. Uh, that 268 looks like it was only able to get one direct hit. Yep. Uh, it was a big one, but big one. not a whole not. lot. Else. Yeah. Yep. yeah. I wonder if you um, wanted to you play want to go down? Uh, that far down. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll go down on your six. Uh, yeah, sure. Really fast over here, Cutter, going beast mode, twenty four thirty seven. Ron doing eight seventy five, but he was just you know sometimes you got to do what you got to do and keep your head down. He got a kill. He did his job. Flash Leper coming out there twenty seven fifty two, blocking four. Lonky also picking up a kill. So all all three super conks picking up a kill. Two of them almost doing identical damage twenty seven ninety two. Great job out of the Longster. Then we're going to go over here to the Valor Corps. Beaver coming in there with three kills. 12-19. Great job, Beef. Brother Butane coming out there in the Valor. Two kills. 27-03. Blocking almost a K. Weasel and his Valor. 28-41. Uh, I think you found something at home there, sir. There you go. Blocking 840 in that one. Banshee in the machine. 2,500, yeah, 2,500 in damage, but blocking 3,800, that's what you need Ooh. your players to do. <laughs> he stood Get there. Bowl, making it work. Making it work. Congratulations on your six, winning round two. Where are we off to now there, Otto? Sorry, what's that? I'm trying to, trying to get Discord Which, which map are we situated. heading to? Uh, they um, wanted airfield. Uh, okay. But legit says there's no airfield encounter. That's not good. Uh oh. Um. Yeah. There's uh Jeez. no no um. I don't know where it went. It's gone. Oh no. That's not good. Like airfield all of war? airfield encounter is gone. <laughs> Ed. I'm sure they have the new summer forest though, right? Or whatever that's called. Sunset Forest, or I forget what it's called, that new map, new uh, reskinned airfield. 
Yeah, there's no airfield anything currently. Oh, no. That map is apparently no more. That's a bummer. Um, well, we'll yeah. see. I mean, yet again, we're in the beginning of, of this update. I mean, I'm not liking the transition period from... It's much longer now between yeah. going from damage screen to the screen of the home, you know, the lobby. So there's a lot of glitches that probably are going to get addressed and get fixed. And yet again, this was, oh, yeah. this was a substantial update. So they're, you know... All right, they want Mervanka. Murrow, good one. Okay. I'm wondering in the next match if if RNC pulls out some crazy tanks. I'm wondering if we're going to see an Andre. Oh, in the, in the yeah, after this one, yeah, it could happen. That would be cool. I'd love to see some of those. We were we were uh, testing test firing at them yesterday in our clan, so we were having some fun. I don't know. I've seen how that I, new I, armor profile holds up. I truly think Stone Cold Steve Austin should have got a 57 Heavy with, like, big giant American flag coming off the back, like Budweiser on the side. And oh, yeah. It, it should have been America, you know, America. Yeah. T-57 yeah. Heavy. Ridiculous America. Right? Now, my question Only is, kind. though, <laughs> is they show his picture all over the place, Sergeant Slaughter, but there is not a tank for Sergeant Slaughter yet. Yeah, what's up with that? So I'm wondering what's going to be coming down the line on that one, and then that Patton, I don't know, the Tier 8 Patton. Hey, let me know in, 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 on YouTube down in the comments below. Hey, why, in, while you're there, remember to hit that uh, reminder and subscribe button over there on YouTube. Yes. Lots of, lots of stuff, fun... I don't know, lots of videos. I mean, uh... You have to go back and check out. I know Beaver got these out relatively quickly, so I want to give a big giant shout out to these teams again to do this. Uh, so really fast, we had all L7 KMD all in Tier 8 light tanks. L7 brought out nothing but vanguards and e uh, even 90s. Um, that that light tank match is absolutely classic. Um, KMD doing that one. Um, and then while you're there, uh, the L7 versus KMD match itself is on there. Later Fantastic, on, yes. Yep. RNC, uh, sorry, RTC versus THT, they had a nice slug out. Um, and then we continued to party with the Arty, because we had Arty v Arty, uh, RTC. On Ghost Town. On Ghost Town. <laughs> um, that one was uh, some more crazy wild, what... Uh, other action with RTC THT. Go check them out on YouTube. Tanks are being picked. Back to you, Dis. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, first of all, back to this game here. White Wolves uh, back is against the wall. It is 2-0 uh, on your six. They need a win or they go home. This is their ITW, uh, uh, basically their shot. And uh, they need to really step up their game here. Um, I think uh, Anya Six feels very confident in their trades, and they've been patient, patient in both matches we have watched. So um, they either need to match that patience or maybe bring some aggression and right. catch Anya Six off guard. All right, so this one will have uh, auto and legit go down these. So if you guys want to get ready to be on mic and you guys can run down these teams for us. Yeah, I'll go down the White Wolves. Uh, so we got Lone and Ninja and the Chisels, uh, the War Sausage and Bat Chat, uh, Dragon and T for TK in the Machines, uh, Foster Terror in the Valor, Royal Blood and Ghost in the Super Conquerors. I wonder why they didn't play more Valors. So over for On Your Six, we got Cutter in the E4, Lonky in that T100, Flashy and Banshees and IS7s. Triple Valor by Butane, Beaver, and Box, and an S-Conk by Weasel. Yeah, my guess, my guess to your question there, Otto, is that looks like an extremely mobile lineup uh, with those chisels and machines and bat chat. Uh, right. So maybe look for some sort of rotation or aggression, maybe even coming through the forest right away uh, from White Wolves. Um, I would look at the on your six looks like a little bit more traditional two three line uh, setup. Right. 
Yeah, I think definitely, like you said, White Wolves has really got to pull out a win right here because I think the last time they made it to the finals was season one, so. Yeah, they got they got they got to change White it up. Wolves what, what they what they were they doing? Uh, Sorry. We're seeing the chisels, the bat chat, and one machine group up. So they're splitting into groups of four. White wolves are, and they are going to make a kind of like a pincer play here. Right. Hey Otto, did uh, White wolves win season one? Yeah, I just went and looked at it. White, yep, White Wolf did win season one. That's, what I, th that. that's what I thought. And so this is a B. Is what, this is your guys' fourth season? This is the third season. Th third season, so I mean... Come on, White Wolves. Lon Lonky is looking in her LT right now for where those tanks are. And she does. She finds Lone Killer. That gives a little bit of intel. Ninja gets spotted. Lonky finally Gotta be gets careful. spotted, but uh, has Show. definitely... She might yeah, get don't, jumped. Don't overcommit. Don't oh, overcommit. gosh. Oh, gosh. Takes a shot there. Lucky just... A track. Hit a track hit. Now, she, now she's got some firepower raining down. Oh, and lost her gun. Yep. Weasel, who's her backup, is getting chewed. There's Cutter. Cutter ripping a, a shell off there. Those tanks got punished. The... Uh, or sausage and lone they got about half health and then over here we got a trio of conks well sorry oh, here comes the push great call by on your six realizing that the tanks are split in a 4v4 they are they taking out ghosts six tanks right into them yep a lot of here missed shots go. here super play super play keeper tk running still on reload so Trying to conserve. Royal blood should go down. There it goes. Next Valor Foster is in big trouble. A one-shot fire and done. Lonky with the now kill. On the reverse, though, the E4 and Super Conk on this end are getting focused out. Cutter does take down Lone, though. Looks like Weasel might go down right here. Cutter should Good go counter. down. Good counter. Yeah. Good counter push. But uh, if you look at the hit points, uh, not even close. 51 Oh, to Cutter gets off another round. Deadly. And, and, and right now, I would just keep this this pain train rolling for on your six. Ninja to Chief going down, not lasting long. Great focus fire out of the on your six crew. War sausage engaging Lonky. Hey, get down, Lonky. Lonky, yeah. Instead of come up and over on them here, Hells. Yep. On your six, looks like they're going to wrap this up in a nice tidy bow and move on to the next round. Otto, do we know who their, One tank left. Who their uh, opponents should be? I think it's uh, 12, 12 Panzer. Yeah. Go ahead. I'm sorry, Otto. Oh, uh, 12 Panzer and RDM are, I think they're battling on Sunday, so we'll, we'll cool. know by then. There it goes, three and out. Uh, on your six was very impressive tonight. Yes, Just, sir. Uh, really good focus fire, like you said, Hells. And that uh, first initial overmatch push through the cap was uh, outstanding. Yes, sir. You want to go through some damage? Yeah, let's go through some damage. We'll look at the White Wolf side first. Uh, Royal Blood in the Super Conqueror, picking up a kill, putting out over 2K. Um, only other real big notable is maybe T for TK in the machine, putting out uh, 3573. Um, those are the only two that really broke a thousand or two thousand. Over on the on your six side, uh, again one of the things we've noticed in all three games is they have been doing an excellent job of uh, getting everybody involved and everybody doing their job. You can see Weasel right there at the top and the Super Conqueror putting out. 2100 even um, with 790 blocking. Uh, Cutter in the E4. We we're watching him do some work. Put up almost 3K, picked up a kill. Good game there. 
Uh, Lonky with all those spots and in intel at the beginning of the game there, still able to pick up a kill and put up uh, over 1,200 in damage. The Valor crew was working. Butane uh, putting up 2,600 and picking up a kill, blocking 1K. And then look at 